Hi all Chris here and uh, I've just got a video update on my uh, UHF analog transmission. I've, in case you're wondering, that's my parents being weird and I woke up this morning to them speaking Norwegian so I'm not sure but anyway here's a um, little uh, booster I bought. It's got also got variable gain as well which is handy. Still the same old set top box divider and I've still got this antenna mounted on the wall up here. But over here I've changed the antenna on this to a um this is one of the antennas for the AM radio on an old VCR player and um surround sound unit and works perfect. I've got perfect reception on this. I've got rabbit ears on this one. Perfect reception. This one's still under restoration. This one's VHF only. My Sony I've got um, directly connected to the set-top box for guaranteed perfect reception. And then lastly, before my camera runs out of battery power, I've got my little desktop television here. And the reception on this one could be a bit better, but the antenna on it's been broken up here, so... Yeah. Anyways, still it's good enough to see and hear. So yeah, that's just it. Just thought I'd give you a quick update on it. And just down there's my iMac, which I've pulled apart to fix because it stopped working. And the um, main high voltage capacitor here's got a bulge in the top, so it's due for replacement. Unfortunately this thing must have copped an impact when it was in the dumpster because I opened the case and found all this so it's, it's a shame. It's a nice computer. I'm going to try and glue that back together and it hopefully won't be too visible when I put this back on. So anyways, yeah, so there's my analog broadcast working perfect as ever so I'm really happy with that and yeah I like to use these I use all the tellies a lot now the desktop one but these two especially I fell asleep last night watching my old black and white actually so yeah so if you do collect old tellies this is definitely worth looking into so yeah cheers Chris